for a long time. I cannot remember two nights in a row, non-stop, green to checkered. Six minutes and 45 seconds last night, 7.45 tonight. Roger Crockett wins both nights. Again, folks, let him hear you. last 24 hours. It's unbelievable. Um, first off, you go non-stop. It's awesome. It just shows how much room there is in racing here. Um, I can't imagine the, the race that fans got to see tonight. Um, it was unbelievable. I mean, you know, I'm battling there with Seth, and um, you go back up a little bit, you know, you see Chad Dolan up there and Kyle Miller, and they tingle a little bit, and Seth goes by, and here comes Chad back, and gets a little bit, just, there's action all over, and, you know, I'm just about stopping in the bottom, trying to make something happen, and we're pretty darn even, and you know, here comes Solar in the mix, it's just unbelievable, and um, fortunately I got the map cards off the bottom, and I was able to squirt through there and uh, get back at the top of the better. Which one was more fun last night and tonight, because they were two totally different races for you. Yeah, um, I think last night was more fun after this so much. <laughs> um, you know, it took a lot of patience tonight, and um, just experience, and I know the guys are racing around, we're going to get the room, um, the last cars, you know, just had to worry about them, and uh, just put on a heck of a show, and I'm uh, really fortunate to be out here, and we were at again. It was good to start eight tonight and uh, get the race all the way up there. Um, you know, obviously it's nice to start the front row, but also it's uh, a lot better sometimes to feel a bit better starting eight and a half row. Do you remember two nights in a row in sprint car racing and non-stop like this? I can. I don't think we run two races in a row non-stop. We have got our heat races even, you know, it don't happen very often. So uh, you go, you know, 60 laps non-stop was awesome. Uh, you know, it's great for the fans. You can sit right there in the edge of the seat and watch the whole race and not get bored with the old flags and people spinning donuts and stuff. As I said, uh, any one of you in the top five could have won that thing. Seth Perfect, for a little while there again, got himself a bit of a lead, and then again, the laptop and pumps in the play. Talk about uh, the move that you made uh, for the win. Yeah, it's, um, you know, we got a little bit out more, got out there, got out there a little bit better there, man. You know, he got up in the top, there wasn't enough cars up there, and so I jumped back up there, and you just kind of try to catch him, and when you get back in the track, it's time to get down and do something else. You know, if he ever went to the bottom, I just got on the top. So it's one of those deals, you know, where he's got to be in the race, um, you know, he's got to make the decisions, and, and also he's got to have things fall his way, and, um, you know, there's not cars everywhere, so it's, there's no easy way around it, and uh, it's nice to have the track so wide and racy, though, as we can use every inch of it. Roger, on weekends like this, back to back, you're not thinking about the prize money, you know. You're not thinking about the points. This is just about good old-fashioned sprint car racing, isn't it? Yeah, actually, it's just about, uh, about trying to be the best each night. We come out every single night, and we're where we're at, trying to be the best. And, uh, you know, it's like you said, it's about racing. I'm thinking about the prize money or anything else. You know, I, first thing I might have done with me to show I don't have to win from the front row. And so, of course, we're able to do that tonight. Of course, you uh, lead the series with three wins on the season of New York State. You're nice for the lead. Oh, 39C, you finished third, you know. Yeah, he's right there. We're definitely looking to shake him this week. And I'm um, sure it's going to be the same thing all year. At least I hope we can keep our own front. I know he's going to be up there. So, uh, you know, long as you go to that, we're definitely heading right back to the sure. Unbelievable performance, Roger. And uh, we can't wait to see you again. Congratulations, and we'll see you next Monday in Bedford. That will be in Bedford. That's our studio next Monday. And, um, all you guys that are here and you're watching this weekend, I think it's the 23rd, 24th, we have a time for Zing Month. You're going to see everybody's going to race some of the best in the country. And uh, hey, look around here again, but that's something you definitely want to miss. You've got some unfinished business, both of y'all, but anyway, don't you? Yeah, definitely won one of the four last year. And uh, the second year in the final night, so um, definitely just keep getting better and better here. And, and hopefully we can take those guys down. Hopefully all of our best guys can. Nice job, man. Thank you. Roger Cochran, race fans. Simply unbelievable. Well, here's Seth Bergman in second place. Seth, uh, give a hand, folks. Seth Bergman in the 23. Seth, uh, your only order is going to remain being here at Pot of Troll, and uh, guys, you're pretty close to getting your uh, second win here. Uh, how close was it?